Also, chat, my boy James is here. I don't know what he, I don't know why he said that's the people's spoiler. I didn't say anything about spoilers. Uh I didn't even say nothing about spoilers. I just I've been saying I feel like Yuri is suicidal. Which I'm pretty sure she is. Cause I, I saved scum well, it kinda saves scum. But I literally say if I say suicide and she jumps up, she is suicidal. I am 95% sure she is suicidal. There's no way she gets jump up over the light suicidal, bruh. She has to be suicidal. Extraordinary. Alright, but no, we, we, we'll see. We'll, we'll see. A childhood. Those are the words I chose. If I see her do some suicide shit, James, I'm gonna go off on you. That's what I'm gonna say. Uh, yes, I'm gonna go off on you. Because I know but she has to be. Aw, oh, man. I'm the last one here again. Don't worry, I just walked in too. Were you practicing piano again? Yeah. <laughs> you must have a lot of determination. Starting this club and not picking up a piano? Well, maybe not determination, but I guess passion. Remember that the club wouldn't be here if it wasn't for all of you. And I'm super happy to tell that you're all willing to help out for the festival too. I can't wait for the festival. This is gonna be great. Eh. Weren't you complaining about it just yesterday, Nasuki? Fuck Nasuki. Well, yeah. I'm not talking about part of the festival, but it's a whole day of school where we get to play and eat all kinds of delicious food. You sound a bit like Sayori all of a sudden. Monica, do they usually have a have fried squid? Squid? That's just pretty specific to look forward to. Oh, come on. Are you saying you don't like squid? You of all people? I didn't say I don't like it. Besides, what do you mean by all of you, by you all of people? Because it's right in your name, Monica. Eh, that's not how you say my name at all. Also, that joke made no sense in translation. Eh? Never mind. Let's just focus on our event for now, okay? <laughs> bye bye. Your actions are fun as yours, also yours anyway. Excuse me? Where is a Yuri anyway? There you are. So you're sitting on the desk in the corner looking down at nothing. I walked over to her. Hey, Sayori. I wear my hair in front of her face. You're spacing out again. Don't we walk with her in school? We didn't watch her. We didn't walk with her to school today? Why she acting like that? Of course. Why wouldn't it be? It just feels like you're a little off. Sorry for assuming things. I'm back to use that too. Maybe I should ask Monica because she knows something about you. Well, have you noticed anything up with Sayori anything recently? Anything up with her? In what way do you mean? Maybe I'm reading into it a little bit too much, but she's seen a bit downcast today. Oh, you think so? I can't say I noticed anything about her. Monica appears across from a Sayori who is only dragging and racing up down. Maybe there is something on her mind, but I'm surprised I'm not, I'm not the one asking you, Reg. You certainly know her a lot better than I do. Yeah, but she's never really liked this. She always talked to me ab about things that bothered her, but this time when I asked her, she's re really dismissive. Sorry, I know it's not your problem. I just wanted to ask if you knew anything, so I'll drop it now. No, no, it's important to me too. I mean, I'm also friends with her, and I also care about the well-being of my club members, you know. Maybe I'll try talking to myself. Are you sure about that? She seemed like she really wanted to be left alone. Are you sure? Maybe she just has a hard time breaking up with a, uh, with a person of interest. Person of interest? What do you mean by that? I'm saying that maybe the thing on her mind is you. Me? How on earth would you come to that conclusion? Well, well. I, I probably shouldn't say too much, but Sorry talks about you more than anything else, you know. Eh? She's been so much happier ever since you joined the club. It's like an extra light was turned to the side of her. What? No way. Suri is, is always like that. She's always been full, so, full of sunshine. It's not any different now than it has always been. 
<laughs> You're so funny. How you how you thought the had thought that maybe you always seeing her as so cheerful because that she because that's just how she is when she's around you. I said too much. I'm sorry. What do I know anyway? I didn't mean to jump to conclusions. So you should forget what I said. I'll try to talk to her. So try not to think about it for now. All right. I know she said to forget it, but I already know that I won't be able to get the words out of my head. I want you to know next to her and gently talk to her. But she's person I can't hear from her. Outside, I sit myself down. I know Sierra told me not to worry about her and have fun with everyone else, but that's impossible doing when she's behaving like this. Exactly how much do I care about her? Yeah, that's that I'm learning is not so much. Now it feels like I'm the one behaving out the ordinary, but there's nothing I can do besides wait for Monica. Okay, everyone. After some passes, Monica calls out to the classroom. Why don't we share our poems now? Before I know it, everything is about to normal. Everyone goes to retrieve the poems and I do the same. I'm making all the comments with Monica and she smiles. I wonder what she was talking about with Sayori. Who's... Do I want to get all, you all... I, I need to know what's wrong with Sayori. Or do I save her for last? All right, James. She's gonna save it for last. I'm gonna, I'm gonna listen to. I'm gonna listen to you. <sighs> let's let's talk about let's talk to Yuri right quick. I probably should not have done something to Yuri. I think I think what Yuri just no 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 no. I don't think Yuri likes me. I see. I think you're proving not the right in general. You guys can't help but feel a bit foolish. What for? Just I feel like I kept trying to offer advice when it should include me that you prefer a different writing style. I probably just sound arrogant. I'm so stupid. Yuri, that's a little no. You don't understand. I spent so much worry about what's better and what's worse. Not just with you, with Nusuke and Sukusuri. It's obvious now why nobody has fun when talking to me. And because of that, I'll just keep my mouth shut about your poem. Yuri bears her head in the arms of the- Why is everyone being so depressed? I don't think it's ever the- I think people really didn't- Really would be a lot more obvious. I know that you really like to read deeply into things, but there's something just worth taking at face value. I just, I gotten so used to it that it's hard for me to comprehend any other possibility. Gotten used to what? Reading deeply into things? Being disliked. Yuri, what, what am I saying? I'm sorry. I never meant to bring this up. Yuri turns away from me. You should go. Please. Please don't look at me right now. I don't want, I want, I want to do some thinking. Are you sure? Yuri nods. All right. I'll leave Yuri be. Come for him. So when she wants to be alone, I think I can see him. I feel bad, but thankfully, she doesn't take it out on me. I'll wait until she's feeling a little bit better. Okay, uh, Nasuki. There she go talking shit again. I'm trying a little bit. Of course. I'm at least, at least I'm trying. Why are you emotionally invested in my poems anyway? Is that more? Is that more of a compliment to me? Eh, no, gross. It's not like I care. It's just that one of us in the club has to make sure you're not slacking off. Well, you ended up just scaring me anyway. That's um. It's not like it's not like you actually want will do that. It's kind of fun to hang out here, even if I have to put up with you. <laughs> That's like, I'm looking at my stomach. Oh, maybe I want my scaring you away after all. I was just joking. I wasn't. Oh, oh I know. Don't worry. I was too. <laughs> How the hell do you call that a joke? That seriously hurt. Maybe it was funny to hurt. I guess that's kind of the point. I should really just watch my mouth around this suki. Anyway, what was up with phone? I didn't even get to read Yuri Pone, actually. Chat, where was Yuri Pone? Why she didn't show me her poem? She has to. That's the assignment. No, wait, let me. Let me <gasps> Ooh, excuse me. I'll, I'll be your beach. Ooh, okay. Now, hold on, this Suki. This sounds a little bit more. I don't know. The name is good. Your mind is so full of trouble and fears that the ministry of wonder over the years. But today I have a special place, a beach for us to go. A shore beyond, a shore reaching beyond your sight. A sea that sparkles with brilliant light. The walls in your mind will melt away before the sunny glow. I'll be the beach that washes your worries away. I'll be the beach that dream, they dream about each day. I'll be the beach that makes your heart leap in the way that you thought I had left you long ago. Mm, okay, hold on. She, Nasuki's getting better with this. She's not just being simple no more. 
let's bury your heavy thoughts in the power of sand. Bathe in sun sunbeams and hold hold my hand. Wash your insecurities in the salty sea and let me see you shine. Let's leave your memories in the footprint trail. Set your freedom in my windy cell. And remember, the reasons you're wonderful when you press your lips to mine. Ooh, I'll be the beast that washes your way away. I'll be the beast that washes you about three weeks long ago. But if you let me by your side, your own beast, your own skin, you'll learn to love yourself again. Okay. Hold on. I, 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 I felt like I kept writing about negative things. So I wanted to write about something nice message for once. Besides, the beast is awesome. Kind of hard to write anything about negative about the beach. So you decided to write about the beach first and then came up with the message later? Yeah, well, it's only because of what happened yesterday. I mean, after Yuri, I realized we kind of wrote about the same thing. She just wanted she wanted to pick a topic to have us both to write about or whatever. I see. I don't really have much to consider you since, I'm, since I actually didn't read Yuri's poem. What is Yuri's poem? You can really, can you make us write about the simple topic and then try to impress me by coming up with something all fancy? Well, it's not like I care. I just did it anyway. I mean, I guess mine ended up being a kind of metaphorical too. There's nothing wrong with this one. Oh, well. At the very least, it was good practice. Why did Yuri not show her, show her, or show me her prone? But which was a some performed the festival. You could want people perform in front of a bunch of people. I have to give it some more thought. Okay, no pressure. But whatever you do, I'm sure it'll turn out great. It will also make me happy to see. Let's take a look at the taste bone. My mind could take the poem I'm holding in my hands. It's kind of funny. How so? Not no, not the poem. I mean, it's funny how your poems and you have been getting more and more similar to each other every day. I'm surprised you're you're so in sync with her. Then again, you have spent a lot of time together lately, haven't you? I guess you could say that. Although we kind of grew up as best friends, I haven't seen as much of her this past year. But since I joined the club, we've been spending a lot of time together again. I see, I see. That reminds me about Sayori. Been a little off today. Yeah, did she tell you something? Uh, well, you haven't been you haven't been flirting with her, have you? Of course not. I've been treating her like I always do. All right, just making sure. I know how much you care about her. It would be terrible if something bad happened to her. So keep an eye out. So you've been acting so much happier ever since you joined the club. What could happen all of a sudden? Never mind. This really isn't the time to talk about this. Anyways, I'll share my point with you now, all right? The lady who knows everything. I will tell of a lady who wanders earth. The lady knows everything. A beautiful lady found every answer. All meaning, all purpose. And all that I ever saw. And here I am, a feather. A loss of drift of sky. Victims of the currents of the wind. Day after day I search. I search with a little hope. Knowing legends don't exist. James, fix your damn mic. Thank, thank you. <gasps> But with all the with all that else has failed me, when all the others had turned away, the legend in the remains, the last dim star glimmering in the twilight sky. I total sky. I I I that words for difficult to read. Uh until one day the wind ceases to blow. I fall and I fall and fall and fall even more. Gentle as a feather, a dry quill expressionless. But a hand catches me between the thumb and the forefinger. In the hand of a beautiful lady, I look at her eyes and find no answer to her gaze. The lady who knows everything knows what I'm thinking, for I can speak. She responded in a hollow voice. I have found every answer, all of which will amount to nothing. There is no meaning, there is no purpose, and we seek only the impossible. I am not your legend, your legend does not exist. And with a breath she blows me back afloat, I picked up a, a gust of wind. Okay, I like this. I feel like I'm learning, looking for answers that give me like a meaning. Not to give philosophy or anything, but it was kind of my mind. So that's what I wrote about. I see. I never put really much to talk to it. In a way, it's almost paradoxical because if we had all the answers, when the world start to lose its meaning, you know, that's one thing I noticed. It seems like everyone in color right, is about more and more happy. Are you surprised? I mean, if everyone's okay, we wouldn't really have the right thing about, would we? Humans are two-dimensional creatures. Mm. I think you know that better than anyone. You mean one-dimensional? Oh yeah, that. Here's Monica's answer for the day. Are you ever too shy to show you right because you're afraid it's not that good? It can be really disheartening to get real responses to the answer. But if you find other people joining right, sharing becomes a lot easier. Because of that, telling you right is good, okay, or bad. They'll focus on work on. It's much more encouraging the way it will make you want to continue improving. It's almost like having your own little club, don't you think? That's my advice for the day. Thanks for listening.
Oh, did you last say right? I'm still tripping on, all right, on Monica. So the last, um, or Chad will probably know this, but last thing was she told, she straight up said for the tip of the day was save the game. What? What is that? What do you mean? That's breaking the fourth wall. So you already, this is your best one so far. It's really nice, Raj. Thanks. Um, you've been a little quiet today. Is everything all right? Eh, of course. Everything is fine. Maybe I'm just a little tired today. <laughs> Do you want a nap or something? No, that's silly. Don't worry about me, okay? I only want to see smiles on your face. Well, all right. Hey, Reg. I'm still a little surprised. I really thought you would try writing your poems like the, like the way Yuri does. Or even this, okay. But in the end, yeah. I guess you're the one who, who likes this, this one the most. Why? You don't want to get closer with everyone else? Wait, of course I do, but that doesn't mean I need I need to try so I saw the press them. I still understand you the most, Ayori. I know you have to sometimes James, are you sleeping? James I know this nigga's not sleeping in the middle of the bed. James You eat you snore while eating? <laughs> Bro, it's not like you were snoring. <laughs> All right. Psychopath moment. What's psychopath moment? I didn't do nothing. Oh, but I, unless you talk about like I, the only like the only thing that happened with me and her was literally she just didn't want to show me her palm or some shit. But kid, why did she not show me her palm? And I had to sometimes put up with you, but we have a way of her something. This, and this is how the poem came out. Sometimes I feel like you're the only, that you're the only excited thing in my life. So sometimes it's just easier to write when thinking about you, Sayori. No, I don't think I don't deserve this. You're too nice to me. Why are you doing this? So you have trouble keeping her voice steady all of a sudden. If you have fun with everyone, so I'm sorry, this would be so much easier. I glance around the room, make sure. Is Sayori suicidal? That won't happen if it's just me. I'm scared, bro. What do you what? So sorry, and you that's right. You did. I'm just a catchphrase. I don't have a catchphrase. Jeez, why is it the most so weird today? But even you is going to be into it. I don't know how light the mood does that shit. Someone's like, wait, wait, what did they mean though? Wait, why is Yuri being like that though? Like, she just went home early all of a sudden? And saying this will make it, this will make it. Uh, I'm worried about her this whole time. Alright, no, wait, I'm trying to keep my mind off her. Okay, come on. She actually wasn't feeling too well with home early. I hope she's alright. Seriously? Well, I'm trying not to go home with her. You picked the time she's not feeling well? So so much for you two being all lovey-dovey. Uh, no, first of all, stop misunderstanding my friendship with Surya. And second, she's kind of been avoiding me today and I didn't want to force it. Oh, it's that curious expression coming from you, Of all people? Calm down, guys. I talked to her earlier and everything's fine. What did she say? Well, we need to figure out the rest of the festival pressure with yourself. Why are you? That's the side where I want to be, man. I want to know. What is she thinking? What are you doing? What I'm doing, right? That's right. This is you can make a cupcake, but we might need to clean a lot of them with different flavors. Can you handle that by yourself, Nasuki? Try and accept it. As for myself, I'm going to be printing and sending all the poetry pamphlets. So it will be helping me design them. As for, as for Yuri, Yuri, you can, um, guys, can you help me come out with something for Yuri? I'm useless. No. No, that's not at all. You're the most talented person here, you know. Damn, oh, okay, not, not the Suki Pollen too. Jeez, I, even I can tell that. I guess I never gave her no credit, but I can tell things are even harder when she's not around. 
that may be the case. But if I can be also be with my own, then I won't grow as a person. So you, you have you have beautiful handwriting though. So you should make some banners and decorations to help you set up the atmosphere. Atmosphere? That is true. She could write cursive. I can't read cursive, but she could write cursive. I love atmosphere. Your expression suddenly changes after she stared at us and starts nodding to herself. Your body is already racing. I see. That's great. You will be a wonderful help, Yuri. Well, anyway, that just leaves you, the one who's the one who is truly useless. <laughs> Don't say that. In fact, Moon is okay. Yuri has some pretty heavy tasks to handle. It would, it would probably would go a long way to give one of them a hand. Okay, you can always help me out as well. I would really appreciate that. I want to go home to see what so Yuri's up to. America, give me a choice that you should be sitting on your butt anyway. That's a good choice to mumble a bu bunch of excuses like that. Um, if I recall, Nusuki, you mentioned that you would like to handle the bacon on your own. Ray may not be around if you only make him out to be a nuisance. So therefore, he may be suited to assisting with decorations. Don't make me choose who I want to work with, bro. I don't care. It's just an assignment. And bacon is it. So just what do you think? Guys, guys, let's settle down for a moment. In the end, I think it's up to He hasn't really gotten a chance to spend any time with me yet, you know. So I'm sure he's interested in it. You literally just said, I'm surprised as well. Sorry, sorry. I was just saying, though. Jeez. Can we just settle this already? Yeah. But are you okay with this, right? In the end, it's up to you. <laughs> Why am I going to get choices? <laughs> Very well. In that case, if it looks straight at me. But of course, I'm going to go with. Uh, I want to say this, but I want to give her space. I want to say this, but I'm not. I'm not gonna say I'm not vibing with her, but I don't know. It's just childhood thing, you know. Natsuki, fuck you, Monica. Yeah, I don't know. I just want to hang with her, if I'm going to be honest. So I'm going to uh, go with my gut and yeah. Man, I mean, you are your neighbors, man. But Monica said, Monica said that so you would be helping her. Jeez, do you really hate us that much? No. Sorry, I didn't mean to. Just. Then, and yeah, that's I mean, if Monica and Yuri, wait, so why are they giving me Monica and Yuri? So it's me, literally me choosing between Natsuke and Yuri. We're gonna go with Yuri. Well, I'll probably be the mo most helpful out here helping me. Are you serious? Why would you, Natsuki? I can already tell you're about to say something to me. No, I was just saying. Ugh. So you be helping me, Yuri? Yeah. Then that's when I'm glad. I'll be. I have a bad habit of overthinking these sorts of things. So, um, so I think your sister would be very useful. That's great to hear. Maybe I should have did, Monica. Hmm. James, how's story? <laughs> I don't, I don't really know why. Hmm. Your, your cupcakes are the best cupcakes I ever heard. Uh, I think they go really well with my tea. And then nothing really good into. Should I have one? I probably should have went with Monica, huh? I don't know if I'm going to finish this, by the way, chat. All I'm going to say is, if something gets wild, too wild for me, I'm gone. If, if it does get too wild for me, and I'm not too curious. Or I would just need a little bit of a break. I'm sorry for making a big deal out of nothing, but I'm going to say this. You better bet that my cupcakes are going to be the best part of the whole event. I believe you. Yeah, I'll host this so everyone do their best. But with that... Let's get out of here. I'll turn around. Sorry. I realized that I don't have any way to contact you this weekend. Oh, yeah, right. I can't believe that that slipped my mind. Should I give you my phone number? 
I think that we that would be the best way. Yeah. All right then. You and I exchange phone numbers. Okay. Then I'll be stopping by your house on Sunday. My house? Is that a problem? No, not at all. I just thought I would be the one going to your house since I'm the one helping you. Ah, I suppose that makes sense. But if you don't mind, I think I would prefer going to your house. Okay. In that case, it won't be a problem. I decided not to press Yuri for a reason. It's not like it should mind out of way. I just need to make sure my room is clean. I hope I manage to make myself useful some way. I'm n I'm not nearly as creative as you are. Don't estimate yourself. I think you'll make a very uh, make a very if you if you only choose you, even if you only chose me because you felt bad or something. Wait, you don't actually think that, do you? I don't know. It's difficult to come up with any other reason you might, may have chosen me. You're forgetting the one reason the most common sense. I chose to help you because that's what I want to do. But Yuri thinks to herself with extreme sense expression. Yuri, you're overthinking this. You wanted me to point out what you're overthinking, right? Yeah. Uh, I didn't realize I'm telling you what I want to. That, that That's all there is to it. Do you believe me? Yuri think, thinks really hard again. She looks straight in my eyes for a long while. I believe you. As for such a minute after Yuri finally says that she relaxes her expression. If I'm, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Sunday. Yeah, I am too. Yuri follows. I can't believe this. Yuri's going to come to my house on Sunday, even though I would prefer... I would have perfect friend to do to Sayori. My anxiety still shoots to the roof. I guess I got pretty used to handling her at this point. But who knows who uh, outside of school. Okay, that's cool. I shake my head. Why do I feel nervous at Sayori? Why did I choose Yuri, bro? Why? I'm the most dumbest nigga ever, bro. I'm on bullshit. I am the most dumbest. I need to go to sleep. I'm gonna low back. <laughs> I, I low-key went a low back. I ain't gonna lie to you. <laughs> Wait, we gotta go out it out. I chose fucking Yuri. Out of all people that we just literally had a conversation about. I chose Yuri. There's there's no doubt she'll open up a little bit when she do that. Meanwhile, she was the number four. I was already learning more about her, but putting you aside, I haven't heard. Hi, Reg. I sit down in her room. Sorry for forcing first to smile, but it's easy to tell that she's different. There are many sides between us. You have to, you have become more or less of a of you. I guess you're right. It's been a long time. Not much has really changed, has it? So your room is a mess, it has always been. Also recognize the same stuff and emotion and water grace that she had for years now. If you came over the altar, it wouldn't be such a mess. That's because I end up cleaning it for you. How could you suddenly want to come over today? Aren't you supposed to see Yuri today? Yeah, but wait, how did you know that? I left by the time we decided to leave. I mean, Monica told me it's the only natural for her to keeping me informed about the best of preparations, right? Yeah, that's true. But why? About, but what about you? Are you gonna help my, me helping Monica today? Of course. But I'm just, I'm just, but I'm just helping her online. We didn't plan to meet up or anything. Oh, so it's just me and you then? Yeah. There's, there's more signs between us. Serious stance in a random direction. Everything about her is uncharacteristic. I finally get to the point. I just want to see how you were doing after you left on Friday. When something's wrong, you can't hide it from me. I know you too well. So. Her smile shaking her head. That's no good. Eh? Why can't it just be like a, why can't it just be like I always been? This is all my fault. If I didn't get so weak and express my feelings, I if I didn't make that switch that you wouldn't have been worried about me at all. You wouldn't you can't come, come here. You wouldn't have been thinking about me right now. This is about my this is my punishment, isn't it? I'm getting punished for being so selfish. I think that was world I think the world decided I think that was the world today. It was just it, it just must have torture me. So you're right. I grabbed Sorry by the shoulders. What are you saying? Are you listening to yourself right now? I know something happened to you. There's no other reason you can be like this. So tell me already. Until I know, I won't be able to stop thinking about it. And it gives me an empty smile. You really put me in a trap again. You're wrong. Nothing happened to me. I've always been like this. You're just seeing it for the first time. Seeing what? What are you talking about? You're really just going to maybe say it, aren't you? I guess I have no choice this time. The thing is, I've already been in ha Damn. Just damn. Uh, it's, I got two depressed ass people.
but how can she be depressed when in my poems I'm writing happy shit all the time? Did you know that? Why do you think I'm late to school every day? Because mostly I can't even find a reason to get out of bed. What reason to do when I fully know I don't have work or something? Why go to school? Why eat? Why make friends? Why make other people put their energy in carrying waste amounts of time and it? That's what it feels like. And that's what it might have been like. Without anyone worried about me, I'm in shock. I can't even figure out how to respond. How is it possible that Sarah kept this from me my entire time that I know her? Did she really want so, want so badly for me just not to think about her? Is it, is it, is it, I'm going to train as your close friend because I, if I knew I would have done everything I could to support you. You and just only more than you. I would have tried a little bit harder to make everything a little bit better for you. That's why I'm your friend. All you had to do was tell me. You don't understand at all. Why do you think I didn't tell you? Because if I told you, you would have wished ever care about me instead of doing important things. I don't want to be cared about. It's very sweet when people try to care about me. It feels so nice sometimes, but it also feels like a bat being swung against my head. That's why I wanted so, wanted so badly for you to make friends with everyone else. Helping everyone be happy is the best thing for me. But then I discovered something else. Seeing you make friends and get closer to everyone in the club, it feels like spirit going through my heart. So that's why. That's why I decided that the world just which is touch, which is on every path leading nothing but hurt. You're right that I don't understand. I understand your, I don't understand anything else already, but I, but I don't need to understand. Whatever it takes for me to so stop hurting, that's what I would do. There's nothing, nothing at all. The only thing that could help me is everything was, but I was selfish. I finally showed you what a horrible person I am. I made you join the literature club because I was selfish. I was punished by, by my heart hurting in a way that I couldn't understand. And now you came here and I made you hurt too. I'm just weak and selfish. That's all I am. And that's why I'm and that's why I'm so these prejudices. Because I deserve every last one. Without thinking, I once again grab Sayori's shoulders. This time I pull her into a tight embrace. I don't care if you feel selfish. I'm really happy that you convinced me to join a club. See every day make it worthwhile enough. If I make friends with everyone, that's just that's just a bonus. But please never understand how much I care about you. I wouldn't have it any other way. Despite my honest being back on Sayori. Side. She's starting to sob next to my ear. Don't do this to me. Please don't do this. He's barely manages to speak. He's between her stops. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing, but all I want is for her to know I care. If you haven't only called yourself, then you have to let me be selfish too. No matter what it takes, I'll figure out what needs to be, what needs to change. I'll make these feelings go away. And there's, oh, we doing our thing. Then you better tell me. I'll, I'll get mad if you don't. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Gently sorry, finally puts her arms around me in your turn. I don't know anything. It's all really scary. I don't understand any of my feelings. The only time I'm not feeling nothing is when I'm feeling nothing is when I'm feeling pain. But your hugs are so warm, and that's really scary too. It lets me go, and she does, and as she does, I let her go as well. The festival is tomorrow. It's going to be fun, right? Yeah. How would you like for me to spend it all with you? Um, uh, it's, it's what I want. I promise. I think that would be nice then. Sorry, wipe your eyes. If I could spend the whole day here, I would. Of all other plans, maybe I should cancel. No, don't. Please don't. If you did that, then I really wouldn't forgive you. But it's almost time for Yuri to meet at my house. At the very least, do you want to come along and hang out? Hang out? It would be fine. To my surprise, Yuri shakes her head. I'm sorry. I don't know if it would be a very good time. You understand, right? It's kind of hard for me to fully understand, but I'm trying my hardest. It's okay. Don't worry too much about it. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? All right. I look forward to it. <sighs> I'm suffering uneasy. It's hard for me to keep thinking about it when Yuri's about to come over. I think Sir is right. I shouldn't be worrying too much. We're definitely going to have a great time tomorrow. I should focus on what's ahead of me. As I approach my house, I see something that makes me feel a moment of panic. Yuri? Thank goodness. You're a little early. I'm sorry I wasn't home yet. Were, were you waiting a long time? No, I just got here. But I started to get really nervous when nobody answered the doorbell. You, all, you could always get a text to me. If I had known, I would have reassured you. Hurry, I, mean, I would have reassured you. Hurry, on your own. Uh, I suppose that's true. I didn't think of that for some reason. It should be more common sense, but I decided to ignore it. Anyway, let's go inside. I see you bought a lot of stuff with you. Yeah, that's right. Did you manage to find everything I asked you to buy as well? Yeah, pretty much. At least I hope I got everything right. I'm sure it will be fine. I take Yuri to my room. The first thing she does is glance around curiously, which makes me feel anxious. It's so clean. <laughs> I cleaned it before you came over, so that's every concern you need to do. Uh, no, I would be very embarrassed if my mommy was best while we're here. <laughs> I'm do I do enjoy cleaning. I would have gladly helped you clean. Uh, that would even be more embarrassing. Wait, don't look in there. I snatched your wrist. Let me just draw mine. Ah, I'm sorry. 
I wasn't thinking for some reason. I was just facing out. It's fine, it's fine. I let go of your wrist. She put it in the lap. In her lap, and I was going to check of them. So, um, should we get started? Uh, yes. I have a few things planned that you can help with. Decorations and other aspects. You know, mood lighting, can candles. What are you bringing candles for? <laughs> wait, wait, what are you bringing candles for? <laughs> no, wait, I'm not going to think too much of it. Of course, you know. I want to help our guests in the family place, although maybe you're asking for a couple kids, I guess. I'm determined to provide experience that won't want anymore. That's great. It's easy to forget that you're, that you're a pretty intense person. Uh, intense? I guess so. That's the, way, the best way to put it. Is that a bad thing? No, no, not at all. There's something that I don't like about you, actually. Is that so? That made me feel relieved I, and kind of happy. Yeah, no need to be so anxious. You can relax a little. Relax. I brought some things for relaxation. I was going to use them for, for the poetry. Oh, yeah, like what? Let's see. Remember her hat. She pulls out a few candles. In a wooden cylinder shaped object. I did some shopping on the way here, so I happen to have these in my bag. I plan to cover, cover the windows in black paper, use the candles to light them to on. And I think this would be amazing, don't you? Yeah, that would be really neat. What's the wooden thing though? Oh, this is a diffuser for essential oils. How familiar are you with? Oh my God. Not familiar at all. Is that so? It's one of my favorite contributors to a positive atmosphere. Depending on the oils or herbs you choose, you can change the mood of the air itself. You can feel perfectly your body. Relaxation, positive energy, romance. Reflection. It's almost like magic. You retake the center of the air and push the sponge from Obama. It's just a moment of thin way to spout a small hole on the top. Wow, that smells wonderful. What kind of mood is this one for? It's for, it, this is a jasmine essential oil. It smells like a little sweet and flowery, right? Yeah, that's a good way to describe it. I chose jasmine only because I'm more relaxation. Jasmine enhances your emotion, help you feel the flow to your body. You feel warmer and your heart's warming more heavily. Don't, don't you think that would be more perfect for sharing our poems? It does sound suitable, but you seem to know a lot about this. I'll trust your opinion with anything. You're responding to an encouragement and stuff. She again reaches her bag, pulls out several spools of thin ribbon. What are those for? Well, did you purchase or give me the paper I asked you to get? Yeah, I have, the, I have it over here. We won't be using the paper for a form of it. Well, I'll use it right different on each paper. We'll need about 100 of them. Oh, yeah? What will we be those used for? I'm going to cut a piece of ribbon to hang the door, hang, to hang from the door of the classroom. Then we can fasten the paper or the ribbons to create a doorway certain. Curtain. Wouldn't that be beautiful? It will also catch the eye of those passing by the room. It may attract some some peak inside. That's really creative. I have no idea you're good at this, Yuri. Is that so? Well, I suppose I do get a little tense as you put it. Yuri gives the red cheeks. Is it just me or is, it, or is she more of a last with just the two of us? Maybe it's a little side of sharing the something that she enjoys. Here's a marker. You can write, write any characters you want. I'll help you once I can finish my ribbons. All right. Boy, the two of us are going to work carefully, each other, and then it's not bad right To you, you know. If you promise you won't be weirded out, yeah, I promise. All right. The thing is, I'm caught. Chat, how do I leave? Chat, how do I leave? What do you mean? What do you mean she's into knives? She is suicidal. She is suicidal. James, she is suicidal. <laughs> James, she is suicidal. James, who do you know who's into knives? You into knives? Matter of fact, with all the girl, with all the girls you've been with, have you ever had a girl that said they're into knives? Unless they mean something like this, like they mean they're like more depressed suicidal way. She is suicidal. This is so pretty. I can't help it. I don't know what this is. The combina combination of class. Matter of fact, lift up your sleeves. You're laughing at me? No, I'm not laughing at you. It's just funny how nervous you get about you got about Shannon. It's well, it's just thing you get into, I guess. I, I think it kind of suits you. It does, because she's suicidal. Why is that character dumb? Uh, she is so suicidal, bro. This character is suicidal. Why would I say suit you? You don't say... 
Some cool looking knife. I can't deny that. It is, isn't it? it like to hold it? Sure, I'll check it out. I'm taking a turn on my hands. I f it feels heavy and extremely solid. Where did you even get a knife like this? Curious to off the sharpness. I feel the point of my index man. Ow! Why did you do that? I didn't expect it to be that sharp. I barely touched it at all. It's my fault. I should have warned you. This is a knife that's extremely sharp. It can't cut through skin like it's paper. Oh no. A small jaw and a strong finger. Yuri takes my hand and gives the wound to cut the look. He stares at it and knows he fidgets. If you're squeamish, I'll go wash it off now. Without warning, Yuri puts a finger in my mouth. <laughs> what? I ain't reading this right. Hold on, let me wipe my glass. Let me wipe my eyes. Puts my finger and and just licks it. Not even before it licks it, just put my finger in her mouth. I fear her tongue curled around my finger. Please forgive me. I wasn't thinking. Lowers her head, her face burning up. Yuri, that's the most embarrassing thing I've ever done. How could I do something like that? Weird and took me by surprise, but I guess he was just trying to help, right? I think you're overreacting a little. Oh my gosh, she. Oh, what the fuck? Do she do that to herself? She has to! What? Where she just recover from? Or I guess it was just trying to help, right? Yuri, I think you're overreacting. Oh, uh, she doesn't look her. Where she just recover from this one? All right, you know what? This might be the stupid thing, but I do it anyway. We're supposed to be with the Yuri, man. What? The what am I doing? What am I doing? Did you really just do that? Now we're even. I did. I got this on wall. If it's not for the speed on judgment, the air will be extremely heavy right now. Where do you keep your bandages? Uh, I don't think I need one actually. It it was a tiny cut. Looks like it was. Looks like I already stopped bleeding. This video is about an instance how long it is about to uh, be, but wow. After we finish this, and we. It looks like. Uh, she look. What the fuck? This is, it's just something I saw online, really. Are you ready to move on to the next text? Yeah, let's do it. What do you have in mind? I like to create a banner. That's why I asked you to buy the paint tablets. All right, that's right. What are you about? I was like, need about six cups of water for each tablet. Do you mind fetching those for us? Of course not. Six cups of water. I'll be right back in a minute. Thank you very much. Thank you. Taking your device out the side of you, small. I put them on a plate, couch on the Hey, Yes? I come and see her because I'm rolling her. She cut herself! James! James! I bet she did it! I bet she did! I bet she did! Tell me I'm like- Hold on, wait, hold on. Can I get out the say, what, what, what settings or something? Like, I want to stop the music. Hold on. But I'm- what, 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 How do I stop the music right quick? James! She done it! She cut herself! She cut herself! And you say she did it! She cut herself, James! What did I tell you? Why are you lying to me as if I didn't predict this? She is suicidal! She entered knives. She entered the word suicide. Which I tested. And so Yuri, I'm worried about Sayuri too, because I say death just to prove my point against Yuri even more, and so Yuri jumps up. 
Does the Yuri's kill herself? It's, I see y'all kill herself, but I'm not playing this game. I'm done. Right, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm, I'm leaving it as that. I'm expecting from that from Yuri. I'll admit. But if I see Sayuri dead, I'm not playing the game again. You ended off with that? I don't need to see anymore. I'm, I'm, I'll be pissed off. And yeah, it's too hot in here. Anything? Uh, no, not at all. There's something. Let's mix the paint. Hmm. She cut herself. I know she cut herself. Who you put? What you put? You. Oh shit! I dropped my headphones. But, but fucking. <laughs> bro, chat, bro. Who do you know who she wears sleeves like these? Long ass sleeves. Into knives. Like, bro. What's the drive? And she got a good knife too. And not, not to mention, she even easily said it cuts skin just like paper. Interesting expression, right, folks? Where are you going to write? Well, it would be more fun to surprise you. If you say so. I know I'm so we don't get in the way of each other. You're usually rushing on a few dots and cut across the rest of everything. That kind of remind me of an image of Penny on Ben back then. It's relaxing. In fact, I usually don't even want to. It's just like when I can spend time. I just like when I can spend time with one other person, even something simple like reading. It doesn't matter if we don't talk too much. It's just like having a friend next to me and me feel a little bit nicer. I think that's all it takes for me to be happy. Is that so? Even if Yuri and I are quite different, I can understand where she's coming from. I feel that way, like about like anime games and simply sharing experience where someone can make me happy. I feel the same way. Yuri smiles at me. I knew you understand. Yuri leans over to my grandma on paintbrush. But I'm about to send the clouds of my head to bump into hers. Oh, sorry. Yuri reeled back and quickly lift my hands in surprise. Are you hurt? No, I'm not hurt. I just, it's just started me. That's all. I'm sorry. I should have asked you to get it for me. It's not your fault. You add your face. There are droplets of pain. Yuri's face in that. Is there something on my face? Yeah, I accidentally got paint on you. Sorry, it's totally my fault. I'll get a towel right away. I rushed out. Bunch of phones don't know how water went from the near back front down from there. Here. Oh, wow. I pat down your face and neck with the towel. Is something wrong? It's hot. I just didn't expect it. Sorry. I didn't want to use cold water. Having finished, I started. He suddenly holds my wrist. Wait. Just for a little longer. It feels really nice. Uh. I kept my hand still against your neck. She also she looked at my new tank expression that I recognized from Rebux. Almost like she lost the in front of her own thoughts. She breathes gently half through spotted lips. What is happening? Is that I'm addressing room to this pity? Wrapped around my wrist, sending the sensation on my arm. And suddenly her face seemed to be so much closer than mine which a moment ago. Uh so you're slowly pulled away. Sorry, I was She was about to do it. It's fine. Yuri picks up her brush again, but her movement scene. I remain silent. That should do it. I finished feeling the night sky like stars, like in the barrels. Very bad. I think it came out better than expected. I'm really happy with the results. Yeah, me too. Are you going to add a letter right now? Uh, not yet. It needs to dry first. That's true, but it won't take a while. Well, perhaps it won't be either anymore. I can do the letter in the classroom before our event starts. Is that okay? That's totally fine. Wonderful. In that case, I don't think there's anything more for us to do here. Phew. Aha. You say like you're glad. Uh, you say like that as your life is over. Was well, I'm going to assume that you were at least enjoying yourself a little bit? Oh, no, it's not that. I'm glad that we managed to get everything done. I see. I am too. I was a little, was a little concerned about time. I need to start making dinner soon. Ah, so you don't have any time left? I was secretly hoping we could have extra time after finishing the work. No, I want to stop here. Yuri thinks to herself, I think it would be too irresponsible for me to wait much longer. I'm sorry. I was hoping that we would want time as well. It's probably my fault. Sorry for being such a slow worker. It was not your fault at all. An important thing is we got everything done, right? Yeah. So I shouldn't be disappointed or anything. Gathering all her things, Yuri seemed a little... I understand why. It sounds like she really gets up and just spend more time with friends in a nice environment. But that doesn't mean this is the last time it can happen. Once Yuri packs up, I walk her out to front her. Thank you for having... 
for thank you for very much for having me today. No problem. I'm glad I was able to help. Just let me know if there's anything else you need me to, need me to bring tomorrow. I will. Well then, I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Wait, I can't. I kind of say that without thinking. About today, it's fine that we didn't have much of the times we wanted because we can do this again whenever you want. You can come over. We could go out somewhere. Ah, I forgot you don't like going out much. As I stumble over my words, you always simply smiles bashfully. Anyways, you know what I'm trying to say. I'm, you're very thoughtful. You're taking a step close to me. You're really squeezing my hand. It's kind of what I like about you. Oh, well, how am I supposed to respond to that? But I don't even get the chance to hear you suddenly pulls back. So you're... No! <laughs> 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 no, it's not even cop blocking, but I want to Yuri for the Yuri. Wait, why did the name rhyme? Wait a minute, hold on. Wait, so Yuri, you they're both suicidal. No, they're both suicidal. They're both suicidal. So Yuri, you that boo suicidal. I don't think I'm gonna finish this game. I don't think I already see how this is about to go. I see how this is about to go. It's okay. I just stopped to say hi. To see you. I'm sorry about my way on my way to leave. That's too bad. I'm sorry, but we'll Why did I start this game, bro? Like, why? Out of all games, I'll start, bro. And this is supposed to have horror. For real? Well, I, I, do, I gotta stop in a minute anyway. But, yeah, I gotta stop in a minute. How okay, how you close you got to her? It makes me feel really happy that you made such good friends. That's all that matters to me. Cheers about it. I'm not gonna this I'm so supposed to be happy for you. Why does it feel like my heart's... No, because she's jealous now. She... <laughs> Don't say that. Why did I choose Yuri? Why did I choose Yuri? Why did I choose Yuri? Why did I choose Yuri, James? Why? Why did I choose Yuri? I know all people to hang with, bro. I could have done Nusuki, the bitch I hate. But that's why they made me. The, no, it's, it was the plan. It was the game developer's plan, bro. No, I know how this. This it was the dad's plan. They wanted us to hate Nusuki for how much of a bitch she was, just because of the fact that Yuri is obviously developing something. Monica, I don't know, but Yuri, like. I'm trying to finish this day, bro. I gotta end the video, bro. It's true. I, I gotta end the video. If I wasn't here, then you wouldn't have to waste your simply money. You wouldn't have to put. Then she goes again. Monica's right. I should have just. Monica's right about what? Hmm. What are you scared of? I'm scared that I'm. That I might like you more than you like me. It's true, isn't it? I was weak and started you like, like too much. I did it so much. So much that I want to dock. I don't want you to hurt anymore. I want... Do you remember how I said I know what's best for you? Even if you don't understand, I don't know what I want you. No, no, I'm not saying that. No, no, we say this. We say this. 
those are my true feelings. So there's no way you could like me more than I like you. I should have realized this sooner. But spending time with everyone at the club, making a new friends, I have a very good day if it can be realized that you are the truly most important person to me. That's why I said, yeah, brothers, as long as we continue like this every day with you by my side, then I know we'll both be happy. Suddenly, come around me. Is this really okay? Yeah. I'll, I'll honestly pull it closer. You'll never have to let go of me again. Oh, you said it, Mom. I feel so you're gripping with me a little bit. What is this? I'm supposed to be happy right now. I always thought this would be the happiest moment for me, but why? Even now, why would it? Why would we? They're not going to go away. Yeah. It might take some time for things to get better again, but no matter how long it takes, I'll be there every step of the way. That's all that matters right now. Okay, I try. I guess that makes the festival tomorrow our first date, huh? Yep. What are you saying? I don't. I want everything to. You mean for you as a couple? I don't know if I can handle it. Anything more right now? It's really new and scary to me. If I. This is the best thing for me, right? I don't really understand what certain means by that. Why are you saying. Thing, this is making you feel sad? I don't know. I don't understand what I'm feeling. It feels like a bunch of thorns when you told me. But, but that's why I want to trust you. You know what's best for me. In reality, I never felt more uncertain when it comes to. I know I'm not alone and she loves me, but I'm having much trouble understanding certain feeling that she is, even though I can't comfort her. I wonder if she. if I should be doing something more or something different. I'll do it. Change. I don't know, but I know that I'll give everything I got to the most important to be, and I'll do whatever it takes to have a f happy future with it. Oh! <laughs> All right, I gotta end it. I gotta end it here, chat. Yeah, I gotta end it here. The video's about to be up. Uh, I might continue this, but I can see where this is about to go. But I'm not trying to be heartbroken. I'm really not. I'm really not trying to be heartbroken. No, let me say the game right here. But I'm I'm real I know where this is about to go, bro. I can see. They're giving you hands. Oh, I'm about to be depressed. I'm about to be so fucking depressed, bro, for a few for a whole month. Why did I start this game, bro? Why? Why why did I start this game? Oh, uh. If you want to see more chat, I ain't gonna lie, y'all might have to give me at least ten likes, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. Uh, it, it might come, it might come down to that. But I see where this is about to go. I see, bro. If y'all enjoyed the video, chat, uh, like and subscribe. Mm, yeah, if you really, I'll, I probably will do this again. But if you want this shit to come out fast as possible, I need ten likes at least, bro. <laughs> That's the best. It's about to be fucking crazy. All right, love, love y'all. Peace out.